canción inició somebody out there and I pray that the Spirit of God be for fresh to anybody requiring the blessing of God have an expectant heart in Jesus name I tell you my dear brother we are living in the last last part near the point eight of the coming of the Messiah I tell you in the last days which we are on now the signs and the, the crowd are already trying the lateral rain the sign is vivid it's all out it's obvious God give us his word that when things start to unravel when things start to unfold us as Christian we know how to live and how to respond and what we should do when you see the prophecies start to unfold when you see the coming of Messiah what do we need to do you as a Christian a child of God and you who is non-believer or have not received Jesus Christ what do you need to do I tell you we are living the near time of the coming of a true Messiah and the Bible says do not be deceived by anyone because that time will not come until there is a fall away or rebellion in the church where many will fall away from the true gospel and they will give heed to deceiving prophet spirit doctrine of demons some will be deceived by false prophet I tell you Jesus came or God came to this world in form of a man through Jesus to save mankind Satan is always imitator of God and he will come to this world when he see his time is near he will come by force and Satan will come in form of a man who will be the son of perdition or man of loneliness the beast of revelation spoken by prophet Daniel when you see the abomination of desolation standing in the holy place standing where it should not be let those in Judea go to the mountain let the children of God pray when you see Jerusalem being surrounded by the enemy of the devil it's time to pray without ceasing I tell you the Bible says in the book of 2nd Corinthians chapter 2 verses 1 to 12 the man of loneliness will come in preparation to the coming of the Messiah and many will be deceived because of their rebellion against God Satan will force the Antichrist or the beast to perform miracles who they will fear and wonder and give heed and giving because of their rebellion but the wise will instruct many as book of Daniel 11 chapter 11 Daniel 11 that chapter 11 that the wise will distract many some of the wise will fall or stumble 
and so that they may be clean and made spotless till the coming of the Messiah. And I tell you, God will stand a very strong derision so that those who are disobeying the word of God, they will believe the lie of the devil and the sign and wonders during the last days because all the hells on earth, all the demons from hell will be leads to deceive men. And God will send a strong derision so that the prophecy may be fulfilled. Those who are destined to perish may be condemned for their unsinful nature. And they will be condemned. They will not know until the coming of Jesus. Unless they repent during the time of grace. But the love of God will be upon them. In the last days, many will give heed to the deceiving spirit and doctrines of demons as the Bible says in 1 Timothy chapter 4, verses 1 to 2, there will be deceiving spirit. And there will be also the abomination that causes the desolation will be put in the whole report. That is a sign that was given. Another sign was given is that when you see the fig tree blossom, when you see the Israel coming and getting, getting freedom in 1948, know that the summer is near, the coming of Messiah is very near. And the, the beast and the work of the devil, they try to break fortress, the temple of God, the fortress. They will break the fortress. They will use all their machinery to make sure they break the fortress and the veil of God so that they may intrude and do the desolation. And I tell you, the Bible says, pray without ceasing. And you'll be saved from the love of God who be love of God will be coming to the mankind for their disobedience. And the sin will be at its climax. And the Bible says in the book of 2 Timothy chapter 3, verses 1 to 9, Godliness in the last days. Many will be lover of money, love of themselves, lover of evil than good. Others will betray us. Others will hate one another. Many will hate the true religion, the sinfulness, there will be immorality, there will be lack of self-control, and many more. Read for yourself 2 Timothy chapter 3, verses 1 to 9. That is this Bible you've given by God as a mirror, as a guide. It is the food. It is the spiritual sword, sword of the spirit. If you read this Bible, read between the lines, and you will not be part and parcel of the last time and now and it has have been happening deception that will sweep over many even if possible even the elect of God will be deceived I tell you let's read for God and you be blessed we're gonna sing song let's be kind these are the last why without ceasing if you have not believed in God Believe in the true Messiah. Believe in Jesus as your personal Savior. Trust in Jesus as your personal Savior. Confess with your mouth. Believe in your heart and you'll be saved.